Hey, what's going on guys and welcome to episode 7 of my Bradford City Youth Academy All-Star Series. And in this episode, it will be a little bit of a shorter one as you had a long, a huge one last time. But this episode, we do see ourselves in the Capital One Cup against Swansea City at Liberty Stadium in Wales. Probably... I, not probably, definitely the biggest game of our series so far. And now into the sixth minute, Swansea start off really well with Tian Dolly. They're right back, chipping it into Connolly, a backup striker I believe that they have. And he puts it well just wide of our goal. And now Watkins on the right-hand side, tr cuts back, beats Taylor on the inside. Trefiro now has the ball, brush, turns his man, shoots, and puts it into the back of the net. Pass their goalkeeper with that weird left-footed chip volley, not volley, chip shot kind of thing. Yeah, I don't know what that is, but hey, we'll take it all day long. Look at this. Turns his man and just kind of just beats him to the near post, and that's his first goal in our Capital One Cup. Now into the 61st minute. We're feeling good. We're feeling like we can do something in this game, but Dyer plays it to the back post and just, uh, I don't know who that was, but what is that? What, like, how does that happen? Like, uh, but now into the 72nd minute, uh, after it's tied 1-1, just crazily, they have the ball with Bartley, pass it into Dyer. Dyer puts on his left, but what a save by our goalkeeper there. And now into the 74th minute, from their, from everything, they're just, they're putting on the pressure now. They don't want to go into extra time, and that's, that John Joe Shelby just kills us. Breaks our heart. 75th minute or 90th minute now game's over we're just we're done <laughs> lose to one which uh, to be fair they they kicked they killed us uh, like we didn't deserve to be in that game at all but we were and we could have tied taken hand over time and hey you know you never know from penalties uh, but now we are in the second game of the episode against Wimbledon and as you can see they had a shot in the first couple of minutes and now into the 13th minute brush has the ball beats his man Nice right-footed shot into the top left-hand corner. Beats their goalie easily. Just glides it into the top corner. And now into the 32nd minute. Hergata doing some work out in the wide. Plays it into Brush. And Brush gets up and wins a header. What? Hergata. Just an animal out there. Beating two people. Winning the ball back a couple times. And just they celebrate together. Look at this. He just puts a wonderful ball in. And nice camera work by the cameraman there. But Marcus Brush just gets his seventh goal of the season already. What an absolute animal this guy is turning out to be. And now in the 38th minute. Uh, Wimbledon get a goal back. I guess it was kind of coming, not really. But now into the 73rd minute, Wimbledon have the ball. What a back heel. And that was the worst slide challenge I've ever seen by Warren. Holy crap. They, they just put it right past our goalie, and nothing we can do about that, really. Now Rugani in the 90th minute trying to find us a winner, just doing it all himself. Just like, Marcus, get out of here. I can do this. Rugani just makes the goalkeeper, I believe that was. Oh, my God. Rugani is an absolute monster from our youth academy. The 90th minute, we are now winning 3-2. to two. Look at this. He just goes on a run by himself. He's like, hey, check out this left foot. Oh, I don't think that was Meg, but just puts it under the goalie. So now our two goal scorers, our two strikers, have seven and five goals on the season. Not too bad. And that is how the game does end. 3-2 to us. Brush, Brush, and Rugani with the goals. And now Molina, still in our youth, uh, youth academy, looking pretty decent, but still 15 years old. And into our other uh, scouting reports, Finding some decent players there, to be honest, but we get rid of that 66 potential, and I believe we just we we scout them for another month. We want to we we have a decent team right now, but we want to just okay. Except for this guy, Rubinho can help us a lot. He can he can sure up that midfield, but as you can see, that uh, Aquino's guy didn't turn out to be the guy we thought he was going to be, and now we leave the other two there to sit and just chill out. And then from New Zealand, a couple of decent players. Rojas there, uh, Chikawi, a New Zealander apparently, which we get rid of because, come on, get out of here. And then, like, the file went missing. So we can't really see the next part, but I guess that's the end of the episode. I'm sorry for only, like, a four-minute long episode. But, uh, yeah, next one will be about 12 minutes, hopefully, so... 
Hopefully this isn't too bad for you guys, a bit of a short one today. But in the meantime, if you do want to subscribe, check out every single episode. Uh, definitely subscribe. And if you did like this really short episode, uh, please leave a like. But until then, I will see you guys next time. See ya.